Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm Veronica and today I'm here in front of you because I have a new product to present to you. I'm very happy and thankful to be able to do it. It's a uh, workshop, it's called Scrapbooking for Mindfulness and it's a product that I wanted to be available to basically every English speaking person out there. At this workshop you will get to create using your own supplies so that it's very easy on everyone, I think. And uh, I will show you how to scrapbook in order to live more in the present moment, in the here and now, as they say, mindfulness. These in time will bring in our lives higher level of relaxation, a sense of accomplishment, and higher level of self-compassion, which for us women is especially important because Studies have shown that um, already since the age of 12, 13, women show high levels of self-doubt with low levels of self-compassion. It's a great combination, right? These workshops are perfect for you, no matter if you are a creative person or if you want to cultivate a talent that you have or if you want to discover a new talent or if you just want to relax. I'm pretty sure you have heard of mindfulness and of the therapeutic power of uh, art. When we create art, our brain is 100% in the zone. This makes every creative process basically an informal mindfulness practice. Just to give you an idea of what the practices are in mindfulness, they are of two types, at least according to MBSR, which means Mindfulness Based Stress Reduction. Very popular course out there. So there are two types of practices, formal and informal. The formal ones involve meditation, basically, uh, and you can do it while you scan your body, it's called body scanning, or sitting meditation, also focusing a lot on your breath. And the informal practices are those ones where say, you see a beautiful flower and you want to give yourself the pleasure of admiring it 100% and you look at the disposal of its petals, which remind you of uh, nature's beauty and perfect harmony. This is actually living in the moment, in the here and now. And it's called an informal mindfulness practice. Studies have shown that about 50%, more precisely 53% of our lives, we live in the moment. The other 47%, our minds are everywhere. Past thinking, you know, of whatever happened in the past, or worried about uh, the future. And that uh, means that basically half of our lives we are not that happy, <laughs> which is a pity when you think that it's in our power to do something about it. Now back to scrapbooking, through the activity that it involves, you know, all the measuring, the cutting, the scoring, the gluing, the matching between the different colors we are using in our creations, through the attention that it requires of us, scrapbooking is the perfect combination between relaxation and creativity. Also, through the fact that we are using photos in scrapbooking, because yeah, everybody knows we are using, this is why we create all those layouts and all those uh, scrapbook pages and those mini albums to actually keep our memory there alive and to tell the stories of our life. Through the use of photos, scrapbooking helps us relieve uh, the beautiful and positive experiences in our lives and focus on those memories, something that would actually help us all a great deal. I have been scrapbooking for the last 13 years, and of course I have realized that uh, it relaxes me, but I never thought that um, it would help me in a traumatic time of my life caused by the pandemic, of course, and without going in, into any details, I will tell you that scrapbooking did save me from emotional burnout, and I was on the brink of it. Of course, I'm very grateful that I went over it, through it and over it. And this is why I want to invite you to join me on this journey. Well, I will be very happy to share my uh, scrapbooking experience with you and to show you how regular informal mindfulness sessions will have a positive impact on to your health and on your overall well-being. Will basically transform your grayer days into more colorful ones. We will meet online every second Sunday of the month, the first one being on the 13th of February, and uh, you will get to create using your own supplies. Of course, you will also uh, be able to choose your own theme. This time, uh, we will create a flip mini album 
that will fit in an envelope and that has space for minimum 13 photos of 9 by 13 centimeters. But what is important here is the process, not so much the final result. I will create using uh, papers from uh, Minte papers. In the last three years since I have discovered them, very seldom it happened that I created with other papers than those from Minte because they are really, really nice, really, really good. They make me feel very well, which I think is very important. So this is the collection that I will use for creating this mini album at our workshop. It's called Beauty in Bloom. It's a spring collection. It's absolutely lovely. And uh, this is how, uh, in case you haven't uh, seen their uh, collections until now, this is how they look. Absolutely lovely, I think. Of course, in the description box down below, I will put the materials you need exactly for this workshop. Also, in the link to the shop, which also will appear in the description box down below, you will find there as well the precise materials that you need for the workshop. So, we will spend together two and a half hours of recreative mindfulness. And for every workshop, there is a limit of eight participants, everyone over 18 years old. This is a virtual product. So after you purchase it, and by the way, we accept all cards within the Visa and MasterCard spectrum, you will receive a link with a platform where the workshop takes place. And by the way, no, you won't have to install any new software or to create an account anywhere. However, I do recommend that you use a laptop and at least not a phone. Now, to book your spot at the workshop, you will see that on the bottom side of the page, you will find a calendar and there you will find pre-selected the dates for the next three months. You select the date that you are interested in. It's always a Sunday. And then you select the hour interval that will appear to the right of the calendar. After this, uh, you will see there is a window there for the email address and then the submit button. Then you just add the product in the basket and continue as you usually do when you make an online purchase. If you like the materials that I've shown you so much that you would actually like to create with them, you please uh, let me know in the comment section down below. By the way, we only, only ship within European Union to most of the countries anyway, and uh, usually takes uh, one week for the package to arrive. So that means you would have to make the purchase earlier, so the package gets to you in due time, and also there will be shipping fees added to the cost of the product itself. But for any questions, please let me know in the comments down below. So I really hope you will be joining me for two and a half hours of relaxing and creative fun on the 13th of February. And yes, I know, of course, it's just before Valentine's Day, but I think this can be a great gift to yourself and maybe a dear one as well. Thank you so much and see you soon. Bye-bye.